Good afternoon, everybody. It's Lynn, the Leather Bag Lady. How are you all today? It is another shitty day in the neighborhood. <laughs> it's Thursday today, and it is freezing rain. It's rain. It's damp. It's cold. You would think it was Glasgow today. It's a crummy, crummy day, Leather Bag Lady weather report. But let's get to the bag. And my new do... I need to color my hair very badly at the moment. But she does a good job. She does an excellent job, Melissa. House of hair. Melissa's house of hair. Anyway, guess what it is today? Another vintage Roots bag. And you know I just love, love, love Roots. There's your Roots stamp on the back. And this bag is just gorgeous. Now... It is red. It's actually coming up, maybe not quite as red as it is. This is kind of fire engine red. So it's very, very red. I've restained some of it in the corners. Um, definitely up here. Moisturized the bejesus out of it. Couple of little dark spots just where um, this is rubbing, but nothing of any significance. Uh, zipper pocket, little front pouch, twist lock pocket here. Inside, there is um, a little marker stain or whatnot, but it's all raw leather, and you know how I feel about that too. So it is just absolutely fantastic. Love, love, love roots. I'm collecting as many roots as I can, just because... I really would like to focus mostly on roots. I don't know if I'll ever be able to do it just because I love the hunt so much that I always find something else unique. Like that blue bag that I showed you yesterday. When are you ever going to find a bag like that again? So I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. I keep saying I'm going to do different things and I don't. So I should just shut my mouth or shut your gaggy as <laughs> is said in Scotland. So that is today's bag. It isn't listed yet. I am all set up. Uh, I hadn't done a Instagram reel on yesterday's sling bag. So I just did that and I did, did I do a reel for this one? Yeah, I think I did a reel for this one as well. So I figured I might as well do my YouTube video also. Get all my video stuff done first because it's a different setup. Yes, we're still, we're MacGyvering our way through it. Um, decided that uh, I'm going to try and work out differently until we get to my house. The stairs in this place, there's not many of them, but oh my goodness me, they are really, really hurting my knees. So I did a little Googling um, earlier today, and apparently the crunching that I hear is just air pockets in the cartilage i think it is so if it doesn't come with pain it's nothing to worry about i've got some pain so i'm gonna start icing my knees at night i'm only 54 years old for god's sakes i do not want to invite even further limitations to my mobility as i get older i've already got arthritis in my feet in my ankles wah 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 right but I am not slowing down for nobody so I need to be a little bit more preventative um, and put the fires out before they start and uh, that way hopefully I can be an active old bird which is I think what we all want to be so anyway so that's about it yesterday was uh Still struggling with these cravings. I really am not doing very well. So, um, yeah, need to, well, need to really get my shit together. Otherwise, 8 pounds is going to turn into 10 pounds, is going to turn into 15 pounds. And Pius is not going to like this girl when she's not on her game. So, um, yeah. I don't know why all of a sudden. I think it's being in here a lot. So Pius had said, you need to get out more. And I do, but it's a pain. Like my whole routine, my whole schedule, my whole everything is upside down. And I really am not sure how I feel about it right now. I know it's only temporary, which is why I'm probably getting through my days. But 
it's really kind of uh, you don't realize how entrenched in your routines you are. I remember my girlfriend Sue, she was dating this uh, gentleman years ago and she would kind of laugh at him because he had his laundry day, he had his um, grocery day and and she kind of laugh at him and I thought, well, I don't really have set times for anything, but I really kind of do. So <laughs> anyway, we'll get through it. We were supposed to go to the dump this afternoon, but if the rain is, um, I mean, Pius is going to be soaked anyway when he gets home from work. So I'll, he just messaged me and said, you know what, if it's coming down from the heavens, we're not going to the dump. We can always do it another day, which is true. So we shall see. He was up at 4.30 this morning and woke up quite a bit before that. And uh, he will be a tired bunny, as will I. Well, I did go back to sleep for a bit, I guess. Yeah, I went back to sleep quite a bit. <laughs> now that I remember it, he called me and I was like, ooh, you got up almost four hours ago. <laughs> this lazy bitch is still laying here. <laughs> and he's so good. He's like, well, why? You've got nowhere to be. So we ended up had a sneaky breakfast together at the Cougars and um, came home, dryer broke. So the landlord was here to fix the dryer. And uh, yes, yeah, all go, go, go. So I am painting bags, I'm moisturizing bags. I am going crazy with these bags, getting a lot done. So that is uh, pretty well what the rest of my day is gonna be. I'm having hot flashes, so I had a sweater on took the sweater off and oh it's just one of those days but today should have been a leg day and i didn't do it and i'm gonna google i googled um should i work out with sore knees and it basically said yes uh maybe don't do as much but uh stopping cold turkey is gonna make it even worse you're gonna stiffen up you're gonna have a hard time getting back into it so not that I would stop altogether or mentally, I don't think I could do that, but uh, definitely don't want to do anything that is going to make these sore knees any worse. And I know once we get out of here and into my house, there's no stairs at all. So hopefully my knees will calm down again and then I can resume um, already started programming. <laughs> so let's fingers crossed hope that is the case as i'm about to have a hot flash holy shit Whew. so hopefully you're all having a great day um little quickie today i guess and uh, i will talk to you all tomorrow bye lovies <laughs>